So I'm here tonight just to coach you and just to let us know glory to God but there's another depth and there's another dip that we need to take amen glory to God if you are in 2 Kings chapter number 5 uh, I want to read the first verse so goes the reading of the word now Naaman captain of the host of the king of Syria was a great man with his master and honorable because by him the Lord had given deliverance unto Syria he was also a mighty man in valor but he was a leper I'm going to read it one more time now Naaman captain of the host of the king of Syria was a great man with his master and honorable because by him the Lord had given deliverance unto Syria he was also a mighty man in valor but he was a leper now I'm going to take my subject and you'll get it in a minute and my subject tonight is get your butt out of the way and I want you to tell, not yet, don't get deep on me because I ain't cussing. You'll get it in a minute. I want you to tell three people, get your butt out of the way. And you, you'll get it in a minute. You scared to tell them. You cuss. And then you're going to get in here and you're going to, you scared to say butt. Now you say some worse words outside of here. Did you tell them? Get your butt out of the way. Amen. You may be seated in the presence of the Lord. Now you'll understand where I'm going. Amen. But is a conjunction. Now you got it. So I ain't talking about your ring. You understand? But is a conjunction. So but means that there's something else to come after that that has been said. It means that it is a connection from one place to the next. So I, I came to talk about your butt. <laughs> amen. The conjunction. Amen. The thing that you deal with when ain't nobody looking. Y'all going to get it in a minute. The stuff that you don't do in church that you do outside of church. Uh, I'm not talking about how well you preach and how well you teach and how well you sing and how well you articulate. But it's the but that's got us in trouble. It's the stuff that you don't see in church. Because I, 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 I know the game. Just let me walk it out. Just let me walk this out. Naaman was a mighty man of valor used by God able to amen uh, 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 go to bat for Syria winner amen a mighty man of valor honorable say honorable but he was a leper leprosy, leprosy deals in with the flesh can I just go there tonight and the problem that's killing the flesh is not that we don't have honor in church but the flesh is destroying the church y'all gonna look at me real deep and I'm gonna walk this thing out it's the flesh that's got us in trouble oh come on somebody hallelujah he was a mighty man of valor he was honorable but he had some issues. He was a leper. Hallelujah. It would have been good if the butt was left off. But it lets us know, glory to God, that it's time for us to get everything we can and can everything we can get. I want you to understand that God wants it all. He don't just want a church now that's fragmented and that's torn and just tattered and just halfway in and halfway out. He wants all of us. He wants wants to have everything in our life he wants to be in all through all and above all look let me make it clear I didn't God didn't give me 
me this the revival to tickle flesh. We do enough of that through the week. Amen. And we jump and we shout and we hop and we run and we spin around and we still don't deal with the butt part. In church, we all about it. We got it going on, but we leave here with our issues. Amen. Somebody, we leave here with our issues and we don't want to deal with it. But the reason God pointed it out in the scripture, but he was a leper is because he didn't want us to get caught up with how great he was and all the stuff he was doing and how he was able to do this and that but he could not contain his flesh somebody say sit her down I wish you would I wish you would (laughs) he was a mighty man whoo Naaman was not a child of God. He was a pagan. But even though he wasn't a child of God, God still used him. Glory to God. Amen. To win battles. Praise the name of Jesus. Glory to God. That's why, hallelujah, you don't have to worry, amen, about what God says about you. Even when you're out of the will of God, God will use who he want to use. Amen. At whatever time he want to use them. And it ain't nothing the devil can do about it. Praise the name of Jesus. But Naaman. Was in control but he couldn't do anything about his flesh problem (laughs) he was a public success but he was a private failure have you ever been in front of people and they think you got it going on and then you go home at night and have to deal with some stuff that you don't want to tell nobody come 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 on up in here now see you can't talk to the church cause everybody want to act deep and chill and act like they got it all together but the truth of the matter is I'm aching when I go home at night I got some problems at night I got some ashes that need to be dealt with and if God don't deal with them it's going to end up destroying me can I get two people to say yes hey, hey, hey. hallelujah holy ghost you with me she man die. He can't do the whole side. Hallelujah. Sit. The Bible says then that. Whew. See, what's destroying the church is the flesh. Because we ain't learn how to handle it. We know how I said it last night. We got some of the best singers, the best preachers. But we got stuff, but we got stuff that we haven't learned how to handle. Naaman, a mighty man of war, but he had a lust problem. Naaman, a mighty man of war, but he was on the porn to come with me now. Naaman, a mighty man of war, but he was an adulterer, but he was a lesbian, but he was a homosexual. Naaman, a mighty man of war, but he was a liar, but he was a pimp. Get up off of me, would you? But he had some ashes, and if you don't deal with them, they'll destroy Hey, Hey, Another Mahosiah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Woo. Another Mahosiah. Thank you, God. Woo. Lord, take me on through this. He was a lapper, but he couldn't get off the prescription drugs. Shumanda. He was a lapper, but he couldn't leave the pipe alone. He was a leper, but he couldn't hit it and quit it. He was a leper, but he had a drinking problem. He was a leper, but he was 
Oh, y'all ain't gonna say nothing. An honorable man, but he was still cl- oh, y'all looking real deep, but he was still shacking. Hallelujah to Jesus. But I came to let you know tonight that God is here to set you free, and whom the Son sets free is free indeed. I declare tonight that freedom is gonna hit the building. Is it anybody here that wanna be loose? That wanna be free? Say yes. Say yes. Say yes. Say yes. I didn't come because I needed another church service, but I came to be free. Let me wrap it up.